Hi, boys and girls. Mrs. Perry here. I am going to teach you about this big book I have here. This is called a dictionary. Okay? And the dictionary I have is called a children's dictionary. It's for kids. It's pretty awesome. And look how big it is. So many pages. Look at this. Oh my goodness. You're probably thinking oh, that would take forever to read, right? It would take forever to read, but lucky for us, we never have to read the whole thing. Okay, this is actually a tool. Okay, this helps us find the meaning of words. Okay, when we don't know what a word means, we can look up the word in a dictionary to find the meaning. Okay, so this book, a dictionary, is full of words and the meaning of words. It's like the coolest thing. Okay, because there are so many words out there. We all come across words we don't know. I even come across a lot of words that I don't know. Okay, so we grab a dictionary and look the word up to find the meaning. Okay, I just opened up to any page here. And here I see grandmother, the mother of your mother or father. And that's what a grandmother is. Okay, the mother of your mother or father. It even tells you how to pronounce the word, how to say the word the right way, which is really awesome. Okay, now let's say we came across a word that we didn't know. Okay, now if I said go grab a dictionary and look the word up, some of us might start looking through the dictionary like this. Hmm. would take a really long time, wouldn't it? Okay, we look through all the words on every page. Oh, well, again, we're lucky because dictionaries are organized in a way to help us find the word right away. Okay, they're in alphabetical order. The words are in the order of the alphabet. Okay, so at the beginning of the dictionary, it's all words that begin with A. Okay, so here we have words that start with A and then, oh, here we go, words that begin with B. Words that begin with C and so on. Let's see up a whole bunch of pages here. I got to the P's, S, T, and it goes all the way to Z, okay? All right, so say you want to look word up in the dictionary, okay, you just think about the first letter that the word begins with, okay, and then you jump right to that letter, okay? Let's say we wanted to look up the word water, okay? Water, well, well water begins with W, so I'm going to turn Right to W. Let's see, I'm at N. I keep going. O, P, let's see, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S. Keep going. Let's see. U, V, W. Let's see. We have the V here. I'm at the T. Oh, V. Keep going. Now I'm going to slow down because I'm getting really close to W. Oh, I'm on W. Okay, so this is where W begins. Now water, W, we spell water, W-A-T-E-R. Okay, so all the words that begin with W are also in alphabetical order. So this page goes from, let's see, the word wacky to waiter. Waiter is W-A-I-T-E-R, so I gotta keep going. Let's see, these words begin with W-A-L, W-A-N. W A R, I need W A T. W A S. I'm getting really close. Oh, here we go. Water. The colorless liquid that falls as rain and fills oceans, rivers, and lakes. That's water. Oh, this is so fun. Awesome. Oh, and on the other side of this page, watermelon. Mm, waterproof. Water ski. Wow, so many words. 
All right, I'm going to close my big dictionary here. And now I'm going to share my screen with you. And first, I have a little poster here. I'm going to show you. It says dictionary. A dictionary is a book that tells what words mean. The words are in ABC order. Okay, so here is the definition of a word. The word is cougar. Okay, this word is called the entry word. All of these words in the dictionary, okay, they're entry words. Okay, we also have guide words. Those are at the very top of each page and those help you find which page okay, you would find like on this page here. Okay, these, are the, oops, these are the entry words, all these words here with their definitions and their meanings. Okay, these words up here, these are the guide words. Okay, if we wanted to look up the word hmm, what do I, dust. Okay. I'm gonna to jump to D because I know dust begins with D. Okay, these guide words tell me that on this page right here, the words are gonna go from drumstick to dump. Well, I'm looking for the word dust, dust. Dust is spelled D-U-S-T. Well, dust would come after dump in ABC order. So it's not going to be on this page. I'm going to walk over here. These guide words say dumpling and dyslexia. And that's a big word. Okay, we don't necessarily need to know how to read these words. We just need to look at the order of the letters. Okay, we're looking for the word dust, D-U-S-T. Well, this page goes from D-U-M-P to D-Y. Oh, it must be on this page because dust would definitely go between these two words in ABC order. So I'm gonna start at the top here and see D-U-N. D U R. Oh, we're getting closer. D U S K. Oh, dust. D U S T. It even tells me that dust is a noun. Okay. Tiny particles of dirt, fluff, etc., that gather on surfaces or in the air. Oh, it could also be a verb, something you could do, right? Have you ever um, helped mom by dusting? Okay. When you dust, when you get rid of all those tiny particles of dirt fluff, etc., okay, you're dusting, then it becomes a verb. Okay, so it tells you how the word dust can be a noun and a verb. It's really awesome. Dictionaries are so fun. Okay, so today we're gonna talk about entry words. Okay, those are all the words in the dictionary um, and what and that are listed with their definitions. Okay, dictionary entry words. A dictionary is a book that tells what words mean. A dictionary has entry words in dark type. Entry words are the words that have meanings in the dictionary. All the entry words are in ABC order. An entry word may have a sample sentence and a picture to help you understand what the word means. Okay, we talked about how all the words in a dictionary, all the entry words are in alphabetical order. Okay, so in the beginning of the dictionary, you would see words that began with A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and H. Okay, in the middle of the dictionary, you would find entry words that begin with I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, and Q. And if you're looking for a word that begins with R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z, you would jump right to the end of the dictionary to find those words. Okay. All right, let's look at this sentence here. The bird flies over the trees. If you wanted to look up the word over, would we look at the beginning of the dictionary, the middle, or the end? We would look in the middle of the dictionary because over begins with O, okay, which is towards the middle of the alphabet. So we would look in the middle of the dictionary. We would begin looking in the middle of the dictionary to find the word over. All right, we will grind corn into flour. If we wanted to look up the word grind in the alphabet, would we look at the beginning of the alphabet, the middle, or the end? Grind. Well, grind begins with G, so we would look through the, we would start at the beginning of the alphabet to find the words that begin with G. 
Okay, a cow can gain lots of weight. If we wanted to look up the word gain, we would look towards the beginning of the dictionary where we would find words with the letter G. Okay, and weight, well, weight, that begins with W, so we would jump to the end to find um, the word weight, because it begins with W, and W is towards the end of the dictionary. And the frog can swallow the fly. If we want to look up the word swallow, swallow begins with S, so we would find swallow towards the end of the dictionary. Okay. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed learning about a dictionary as much as I enjoyed teaching you about it. All right. Now you may head over to Seesaw and there's some practice for you. Thank you. Bye.